Well, last night we didn't make it to a campground. Ended up uh, stealth camping. Didn't pitch a tent, just wrapped the dogs up, wrapped myself up, and just sat alongside the road. Uh, as soon as it got dark, I mean, it was just, there was no way I was going to uh, risk riding on this road after dark. Although, as soon as it got dark, almost no cars came through. I was surprised. Um, it was just very quiet other than the ocean and you can see where we are. So, we uh, got up at about 6.30 as soon as the, you know, as soon as it got light and uh, rode about probably two and a half miles and there was a campground um, although the, they had the sign out campground full so I guess if we would have if I would have gone on a, you know a couple more miles maybe it wouldn't have been full last night but anyway it was a national campground and it looked nice just it was full so just decided you know this early there's almost no traffic out and I know being Saturday it's gonna get busy a little later you know with the tourists and everybody out on the road so I'm gonna just stay on it as long as I can um, while the while there's no traffic and there's a few campgrounds coming up uh, maybe a little later we'll check into get some rest spend the night uh, recharge the batteries. I'm still using my phone because the I've got four GoPro batteries and they're all dead. Um, I'll probably have to pick up maybe one or two more. That seems like that'll probably work for a day uh, since they don't last very long. But uh, it's just gorgeous out. It's beautiful. Um, like I said, you can see there's no traffic coming either way. So, I'm just going to take advantage of it and have a nice leisurely ride this morning. It is just beautiful out there. It did get very cold last night. Um, the dogs, I, I wrapped the blanket around their little tent and then I put uh, just a piece of plastic over that because there was a lot of moisture in the air and it felt like it was raining a little bit even at one time but uh, when I checked in on them they were it was nice and warm in there if I could have fit in there that would have been great instead I sat out here and got my sleeping bag and just got inside of it and wrapped up as best as I could, but it was still pretty chilly last night. Um, so, I'm just, I, I have no regrets coming on the, uh, on Route 1 up the coast. I know it probably wasn't the wisest decision, but it's just amazing, it's beautiful. This would be kind of the ultimate road trip for anybody, I think, to go up the coast on the Route 1. <sighs> I'm loving it. It's just, it's an adventure, you know, I'll, I'll never forget. You know, I've done a lot of incredible things. I've seen a lot of incredible things. You know, hiking into the Grand Canyon in the winter time, or watching the last space shuttle launch uh, from the closest point you could get, or living in the Middle East. But this is just, this is incredible. It's just, I, I love the coast and the water and.
talk to you later.